Hey everyone, it's Linda. Welcome back and welcome if you're new to my channel. Happy Mother's Day to all the beautiful mothers out there and celebrating the divine feminine energies. So I really wanted to just touch base with everybody today and let you know how bad these energies were kicking my butt yesterday. Man, so I have a couple things. I'm going to I'm going to do just a little bit of a review at the end for the new speaker that I'm using. And I know um, you can hear me much better. You noticed I don't have my earbuds anymore. And I'm really grateful to Power Dwise. So I'm going to do a little quick video, a little quick review at the end on that. So it'll only take a minute. But if you stick around, I'll tell you all about it. Also, uh, there's something I wanted to talk about. I want to expand on something I heard from another video. And I think it was Kaz Franklin. And she has a, a channel called Curious with a K. And I saw a video. I believe it was her channel. I saw a video and something that she said just, wow, you know, just mind blown. So I started using this mantra today and it was, I'm going to explain it in my own words, but so you know where the spark came from, go over and check her channel out because wow, um, this just really hit home and it resonated so well. So we all know that there is no time and our left brains can't really conceive of this. Um, everything's happening at once thing, but yet we know this is true. So in, in a way to understand this, um, your birth and your death are happening at the same time. So I know that doesn't make sense logically, but just follow me for a minute. So if everything is assuming that that is true and everything is happening at the same time, if you think of the yin yang opposing but complementary forces and everything is in duality, well, if there is a problem, then there must be a solution. And this really, really helped me so much sitting there being okay with not knowing what's going to happen, not knowing how that solution is going to arrive or appear or be drawn or attracted into my field. So in struggling through, um, let's just take, for example, um, a laptop issue, because I mentioned before I'm having laptop issues and it turns out it's my hard drive. So yesterday I took it in to get it like diagnosed or see if I could do a hard reset and whatever. Long story short, I left there knowing I was going to need $210 to get a new hard drive, get Windows 10 reinstalled, you know, the whole shebang, and it would run much faster, yada, yada, yada. But I didn't have the $212, $210. Okay, so I'm leaving there going, all right, well, I still got to pay rent, I still got to do this, still got to do that. And my son's car was on the fritz as well, and it looked like it could have been a seven or eight hundred dollar fix. So, you know, we're just, what are we gonna do, right? So, I saw this video, and it really, really helped because what we tend to do when we're comfortable is we tend to stay in the, and I want to say victim mentality because you might resonate to that, but we tend to stay in the heaviness of the oh shit <laughs> you know that we tend to we, we tend to hold on to that like a security blanket and I noticed about myself I'm not comfortable sitting in not knowing I like to know and I've been releasing a lot of things so like the need to know and control things or you know be in control of how I'm going to make things manifest me like how am I going to do it so not knowing how it's going to happen and not feeling good about it, it's like you're sitting with that and somebody else left a comment too. So whoever you are, thank you for this comment. Um, and, and this also resonated. It all fit together like a beautiful puzzle piece. Just stay with me here for a minute. So sitting with the, you know, oh shit feeling, what am I going to do? And then saying it's okay to feel this. It's okay to be scared or afraid or not knowing what's going to happen or feeling out of control. Those feelings is okay to feel overwhelmed, to feel like I've had enough. I'm 
you know, you know what I'm talking about. And just to feel that for, but not to wallow in it. That's the trick. Just to understand if you're, if you're looking at the yin yang upside down like this, instead of sideways, it's okay to take a swim through the deep end on the bottom of the circle, but then you got to come back up again. You don't stay at the bottom and keep swinging back and forth like this. It's a complete circle. You know, the yin yang, it's a complete circle. So take a swim in the bottom, understand what you're feeling, acknowledge that you're scared or afraid or uh, whatever. Acknowledge that fear and swim, keep on swimming. Like Finding Nemo, Dory, keep on swimming. Keep swimming through that because you feel it, you feel it fully, but you're also, thanks to Kaz Franklin, um, you're also feeling the upper end of it was if there's a problem, there's also a solution and it comes full circle, <clears throat> full circle. Instead of staying down in the problem and wallowing back and forth, you can go down through, acknowledge your feelings and then come back up to the, you know, the light. <laughs> if there's a problem, there's a solution, problem, solution. You're born, you die. Same time. It's happening at the same time. If there's a problem, there's a solution. Mind blown. <laughs> it helped so much. I don't even know, Kaz, if you'll see this, but I just want to thank you for that because it helped me yesterday. This is another thing I wanted to talk about, the Schumann Residence. Oh my God. I know it, <laughs> I know it says it was 54, which is a lot. If you don't follow this or understand what it is, the earth resonates at a certain frequency and the baseline frequency is 7.8 or 7.84 or 7.83, something like that, 7.8. So if your rate of vibration is 7.8 naturally, and we've been up in the 30s as like a baseline now, we've jumped quite a bit. And you've probably all, a lot of you have probably heard this. But yesterday it was peaking at 54 hertz. Oh, I didn't even know this until I checked it last night. Thanks to Bob. Thank you for that information, by the way. Mwah, thank you. Because I had been, I've checked it before. I've seen this. I've been aware of it, but it's been in the back of my awareness. Haven't paid much attention to it, except when I hear people talking about it, maybe on a video, but I really haven't been researching and digging into it. But man, you know, I went back and I checked again last night. Thanks to a, a sub of mine. Thank you, Bob. And I, I noticed that it was at 54 and I, the day before that, so yesterday was the 11th, so the 10th, which was my 50th birthday. I'm 50 now. <laughs> Man, I've been feeling it. <laughs> but um, that's another balance thing. So anyway, I digress. Feeling it grazed 40 on the 10th. It's like spiking at 40. And then it spiked again yesterday at 54. And I know when it happened, I could feel it. I could feel the spikes through my body. I could feel my heart expand and it wanted to expand more, but I I could feel where the energy just sort of like kind of like not stopped, but I could feel where it hit the density. So I could feel the light triggering on to open and expand the heart, but then I could feel where the light was like kind of stopping around the edges where it couldn't like blow wide open. and. I'm glad it didn't blow wide open because I don't know that I'd be ready. Ah, I'm ready for it. Whatever. Bring it. <laughs> but that's how I'm feeling right now. Today is just like whenever. You know, we, we know we're ready. We keep saying rip the band-aid off, but sometimes I think we don't know what we're asking for because the intensity of sticking with, I don't know, yesterday was frustrations after frustrations after annoyances. I just was feeling really annoyed all day. So I was turning it back, thanks to Kaz, one more time, I would turn it back and say, okay, if there's a problem, there must be a solution, and I need to be okay with not knowing what that solution is. It will present itself. So come full circle here today, celebrating Mother's Day at my mother's and father's house, and my daughter and her girlfriend, and a few other people were there in the families, my sister and her family, and a few aunts, and my son and um, I know my other daughter wanted to be there, but anyway, so family gathering at my mom's and my daughter's girlfriend can fix my laptop for 60 bucks. They just have to buy the hard drive. So 
So there's my solution, $210 down to 60. A solution presented itself, more affordable too. Now to my son's car, the seven to $800 a head gasket issue that it was having. Um, got word from my brother that he could put this um, sealant in this little, you know, hopefully if it wasn't a big leak or whatever, and he came home, we wound up buying it was $32 instead of seven or $800, and it fixed it. It did the trick. Yay. <laughs> so there's the solution. So instead of going, Ah, oh, geez, you know, I shouldn't have invested in the, that car. I shouldn't have put all this money into it. I, I shouldn't have done this. You're shitting all over yourself. And I said to my son, look, and I explained this to him, and he followed the flow of it. He understood. He gets it. He gets it. And it was like, okay, so here's a problem. There must be a solution then. Anything that presents itself has its duality. It's yin-yang. It's um yang It's reverse. Whew. So... There we go. Now, I I wanted to um, bring all that forward. If you haven't been following the Schumann Residence, um, I'll, I'm still recording. Still don't have my laptop fixed yet because I still have to, you know, get the money and get my get it fixed. But I will be able to put links for you in the description box. It just you know might not be right away, so <clears throat> I will get them up as soon as I can. It's a little bit different doing it on my, uh, there's no like saved uploads, there's no things like that. So as soon as I can get back up on a laptop and I can do my copy paste and my research and all that stuff better, I can get all of that to you. <clears throat> now, uh, yeah, so you could also research uh, S-H-U-M-A-N-N -N resonance. And then the one from Italia, Italy, they do updates every single day on what the resonance was for this day. So like what the frequency hertz peaked at. And I think today it was um, touching 40 as well. So that's, it's still, you know, waking people up, shaking people up, brightening things, enlightening things. It's, it's happening. Now onto my review. So I don't like to have, you know, I retired my earbuds. So you guys can still probably hear me, but if I bring this up really close to my mouth, you can hear I'm going to talk a little softer because this thing picks up everything. And I can clip this onto my shirt if I want, but I tend to move around and move my hands. And if I bump it, you probably hear that. Um, it's really sensitive. It's amazing. So I just clip it right onto the tripod stand that I have and I can talk at regular volume and it picks it up great. And it has, you know, a long, long extension cord. And also comes with this cute little pouch. So power D wise. Thank you guys for this. One other thing, it does come with um, extra, an extra little soft thing for the mic and another extension cord to extend it. So if you're across the room or you're filming from a distance, it was only 22 bucks on Amazon. 22 bucks. It's great. I was thinking a starter was going to be about 200 bucks. So I just wanted to give a shout out to these guys, Power D Wise. You can get them on Amazon. If you guys are still using your earbuds, you might want to check this out because, you know, on Amazon, I ordered it. It came the next day. And it was, I tried, what is it, the Prime delivery from Amazon? It was uh, a 30 day free trial. So I'm still in my free trial mode. And that's why I'm ineligible to write a review because I'm in a trial of the Amazon Prime. So I asked these guys, they're going to send me a Y connector. So if I wanted to sit with somebody else and we both could have microphones on, um, they, they don't only ask that you do, you know, an honest review of their product. And I told them I can't do it. I said, but if I do a little review on the next video, would you send it to me still? And they said, absolutely. So these guys are great. If you're still using your earbuds, or if you're thinking about starting a YouTube channel, I highly recommend very affordable, excellent, excellent microphone. And this is not sponsored in any way. I told you it's just going to come with a Y connector for me reciprocating and just giving an honest review. And that's my honest review. I absolutely love this new microphone. And I even thought about doing an ASMR video, maybe. I don't know if you guys know what that is, but I would love to do a meditative ASMR type of video to help you guys relax and whisper and give you the tingles and all of that good stuff. So maybe one day I'll do that as a surprise. But anyway, this back on here and 
say thank you for watching welcome to my channel I can't wait to bring you guys some more stuff I've got some things planned for this week that I hope you find exciting I love you all so much and have a wonderful wonderful week surfing these waves that are coming in really big one is coming I sense it I feel it I know it I I don't know how I'm gonna start checking some videos to see if anybody else is talking about it now so Join me if you're not seeing me on Higher Self. Join me on over there because she's always, Dawn's always got great videos and speakers over there that are really in tune and in touch. And that's how I plan on spending the rest of my Mother's Day evening. Watching you guys and being in the community. So thank you again. Namaste. Have a wonderful evening celebrating the Divine Feminine.